Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Mo, and we are playing some more Stormfall, guys. Uh, I'm having a lot of fun with this game, uh, especially just with the fact that it's different. It's different from other games like this. Look at that barrel coming down that water. What the heck is it doing? Uh, it's different from the standpoint of when you go to the map, guys, you can choose. You can literally choose what you attack. You don't just have to randomly search or anything like that. You can say, all right, bro, I'm going to attack this level three guy right here. That's exactly what you can say. Uh, we're going to go ahead and scroll back up to our account, though. And uh, we don't want to attack that level 14 because that's a little bit intimidating. So is that level 19. We've got a lot of high levels around us, actually. Uh, we're going to go ahead and just raid this guy right here, uh, Sin. We're going to send our troops over there, and they should be there in a minute and 20 seconds. I haven't been training up enough troops, guys. That's one of the biggest mistakes that I've been making so far. As you can see, you failed, you failed, and you raided. So I failed two in a row, which really, really sucks because I needed the loot for it. Let's go up here to um, and exit out of this and go ahead and head back and just see that I need, um, I need resources, guys. So, whoa, what is going on up at the top of the screen? Those aren't the resources that I want. <laughs> what are those resources up there? So, we actually need to, whenever we click on this thing, we can see what our resources are. They're 12, 16, 74, and 629. So, we need more iron, guys. And these are our iron mines right here. We can actually upgrade them for free uh, up to level 4, I guess it is, which isn't bad at all. Oh, I'm definitely okay with that, but we are losing a lot of our loot. So we have to be very careful with upgrading these things. We're going to try and get all of them. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. Exit. So we don't have enough loot to hire the rest of them. We're going to need ourselves some more iron. And the funny thing is that this whole time we were trying to upgrade our iron mines. Um, so we have to be very, very careful with that. We're about to attack in one second. What's going to happen? Victory. Nice. So we didn't get that much from it. Uh, we didn't lose any troops or anything, but we only got 12 iron from that attack. So we are definitely going to need to go in here to our units and train up. But again, guys, we need to get ourselves some more iron from these mines up here. So thankfully, we were able to upgrade them, and they're actually going to end up giving us, us enough iron within probably an hour to where when I sign back on again, I'll be able to send out another attack and, uh, and do some work to these guys. But... We are getting a lot of gold over here um, with our gold mines or with our townhouses. I don't know why I said gold mine, but our townhouses are doing good over here. Now you can see all of these different slots, guys. These are different areas where you can build things. So right now we can build barns and we can build an altar of Weor, but we actually can't build that because we need gems uh, to build that. And we only have 70 right now, so we're going to go ahead and... And build ourselves another barn but I'm actually kidding because we don't have enough iron so we have to wait on this iron over here guys um, oh yes there's a little bit right there so we can collect this little bit of iron it was only plus five uh, but the rest of it is going to be uh, slowly working its way around we can actually upgrade this oh, no we can't so we can't upgrade that one either we have to wait on our builders as you can see our little builder up here uh, in the corner what is he doing what is that guy doing? He's leaving. No, where are you going? Come back. I need you to help me. What are you doing? He's hanging from the thing. What are you doing? Come over here and help me build my freaking uh, mines. There you go. Do whatever you're doing. Just hit on that and just help me build my mines. But anyways, guys, uh, this game has been a lot of fun. I hope that you guys have tried it out. If you haven't, the link is in the description down below. Um... It's, it's cool because it's vertical. As you guys can see, I'm playing it like this, and obviously you can see next to me that it's a vertical game, uh, which makes it completely different. Uh, let's go ahead. Dang it, we don't have enough resources right now, guys. So this is just as, as bad as other games when it comes to, all right, I, I need my resources. You have to really, really plan out your attacks. You have to plan out what you're doing so that you can get enough resources for the money that you're spending in your troops. So when I go in here and I train up my troops, it costs that much, 65 gold, 175 iron, and 105 food, or ham. And I didn't get that much from that attack that I just did. So it was a waste of an attack. It was a waste of an attack. I have to be very, very present 
in uh, what I'm doing and be prepared to uh, send my troops a little bit further because I mean when you go to the the map it's pretty cool you can zoom out right here and guys look at this I'm just gonna scroll I'm just gonna scroll and you guys can see what I'm talking about so I could literally send my troops all the way down we're just gonna stop for the sake of time I could send my troops all the way down here now the transit time does it say what it is? Uh, it doesn't say what it would be. Does it say what it would be? No. So it doesn't say what it would be, but it would be a long freaking time. If I already here we go. Let's see here. So time, an hour and 50 minutes for my troops to travel there. So that's going to be uh, almost, it's going to be almost four hours in transit time, guys. So that's kind of cool, though, because you can go to bed, and you can be like, all right, I'm going to sleep for six hours. I'm going to attack a base three hours away. And you can do that every night before you go to bed. You can send them off, and then you can wake up to victory or defeat, whatever it may be. Um, so that's one of the things that I find so cool. And then you can see up in, in the top right how it shows me uh, how to get back to my base. So that's pretty cool. We just passed it. We are, are, we, are we on our base? Yeah, so we're good to go there. Uh, we're right down there. But guys, I hope that y'all are enjoying this. I know this is kind of another random video, but uh, make sure y'all leave a like on it for me. And uh, yeah, this vertical, this vertical Stormfall game is awesome. I love the fact that it's vertical. We're gonna actually go back and let's see, uh, let's see if we can attack this. Let's just go ahead and attack right here. Again, we have enough troops for it. We're gonna go ahead and send those guys out. And uh, we'll let you know how they do in the next video. But thank you so much for watching, guys. I really do appreciate it. And as always, make sure you guys keep calm and you play on from it, right? See you guys later. Peace.